Hey everybody, what's up? Welcome back to City of Skylines 2. Here we are in episode 7 of Swagtopia. As always, we have the uh, wonderful, uh, you know, cornucopia problems here. Uh, if I can remember correctly, I did want to get started on my downtown area. But I'm thinking also maybe we should build a little, little residential section out here maybe for these businesses. And probably, I don't know if I can expand. I have seven. I'm at level seven, but I don't think I have any more. Yeah, I don't think I can buy any more right now. Yeah, I don't have any more permits. Okay, we'll go ahead and hit pause. I'm going to let the clock run for a little bit. I did decide to dezone all this area since they were complaining about pollution. So, uh... Water and sewage handling capacity exceeds our own needs. So yeah, I know. Of course it exceeds our needs. That's why we're, you know, expanding outward. Oh, that's right. I wanted to get this. I want to get like a downtown area going. That's why I unlocked this area right here. And then we want to get some rail. Oh, God, these tweets. The chipper is going crazy. Well, all right, let's see what we can do here. We have residential, we have a lot of commercial demand, so maybe I'll just, but I'm worried. If I put commercial in, they're just gonna say, they're just gonna start complaining, oh, not enough shoppers. Oh, that's high rent. Yeah, I like, see, you say not enough customers, yet you're living right next to a house. <clears throat> Alright, let's see. I'll branch. Let's see. I'm gonna have to destroy a couple people's houses in the meantime. But here, we'll branch off to about right here. Actually, no, you know what? I want that to be a. I want that to actually be a large road. Uh, seven one day, six one lane, eight divided lane road. What's that one? Six lane road. There we go. Alright, and we'll have this avenue come over. residential area down here. Damn it. There we go. Uh, that come right across like to right there. some room in between. Alright, let's fill this area up first. And we'll also plop down right there as well. Alright, 
right, now let's get some residential over here on this side as well. <clears throat> maybe a little like, um, maybe like a little subtown right here should be good, I think. I know the city is ugly right now, but don't worry, we'll fix it. We just need to keep it going for a little while longer. And all will be well. That looks ugly as fuck. they've actually drastically improved this right now I'm getting about 80 frames per second which is very good 90 actually all right there that should be able to feed some traffic to these shops right here mr. not enough customer bourgeoisie all right that's almost all cleared up And I'll just build some more commercial right here if that's what they want. There. Right there. That ate up the commercial demand. This town should feed into this over here since they really don't have nowhere else to shop. Ooh, wow, we're making 23,000 a month. Nice. Uh oh, what happened right here? Oh, crap. <laughs> Big time accident. Waiting for an ambulance. Dude, what the hell did you guys do? burned down <laughs> all right they're complaining about high rent uh, a higher zone or different zoning may be needed Hmm. What if I lower your taxes a little bit? Will that make you happier? Let's see. Taxation. There. I'll lower your taxes down a little bit so you can help afford rent. How about that? I gotta find a way to disable these because honestly, this sh this is just annoying at this point. customers none of customers well I don't know what you want me to do man like I'm building residential unless I build more residential down here or get rid of these commercial Medium density residential. I don't have any medium density. Oh yeah, I do. But that's row housing, North American medium density housing. Okay, well. 
And let's put some medium density right there then. What kind of future does and music we'll put have some right there. to its past? Well, I say the question speaks for itself. Here on Second Moon, we know you can't move forward unless you keep both eyes steadily trained on what's behind you. A housing shortage is driving up prices in the area. That's right, Linda. But apparently, that's not all good news. We're joined today by an expert guest, Professor Nutbutter. Welcome, Professor. So a housing shortage is bad for the people trying to move here, right? Humans are programmed to desire certain representations within ideological reward structures, which are entirely apart from the actual rewards enjoyed. For example, consider capital. One, one, one final question, Professor. Is the housing shortage going to make me richer? By certain metrics, perhaps yes, in the short term. I like the sound of that. But while we are discussing the study of the statistical abstraction and its effect on the human... Thank you, Professor. It is a question of priorities. Yes, priorities. In the city's export division, sources tell us that our city has more services than we know what to do with. And you know what that means, folks. It means we're not cutting things close enough. Well, no. The point is we're selling it and bringing money into local That's economy. right. You could almost say it's too much of a good thing. Or we could say that we're enjoying a positive trade balance and the economy is booming. More after this. Yeah, that's just my main, like, that's just a highway. So, let's see here. I want this to be like a real downtown area. Okay, I give up with these fucking people. Come on, anybody else bitching about high rent? Yeah, see, now they're going, oh, again, not, see, not enough customers. It's like, look at this. It's like there's a huge commercial demand, but everybody's saying not enough customers, not enough customers, not enough customers. I think this shit is still a bug that they need to fix. Alright, anyway, never mind that crap. We're gonna do our highway. And it's gonna start. Right, we're gonna delete all this crap. All of it's gonna go. What the hell is this thing? Oh shit, the bus depot. relocate you to right here. How about that? Oh, 
Oh shit. Damn it. I didn't want to delete that. Oh well, too late. Sorry, people. You'll understand when it's... Highways. What the fuck? What the hell's happening right here? Oh, because the electrical wires, that's why. Alright, I think I gotta do delete. Yep. And then delete that one. Crap, can I not delete this one? Oh, it's not letting me delete it. to worry about that later then I guess oh shit everybody's cut off well that's not <laughs> I did cut off the entire right hand side of the city didn't I oh now I got a lot of problems to fix oh yeah we got a new building all right cool that, that's nice all right let's just keep um Highways. Old and 
not really working out anymore. Alright, so super highways connected for right there. I'm sorry, everybody. I'm so sorry. I gotta run this highway all the way through. Gotta relocate this because that's in the way. Relocate the bus depot again. There. I'm probably gonna have to redo all the bus lines too. But hey, that's the fun part of the city. Once you get to a good spot and you want to remodel, just destroy everything and start over with all the money in the world. That's the best part. I mean, theoretically, I don't need the highway to go this high on a technicality, but it's like, you know, we might as well, right? Have a straight through shot. All right, so now, we're gonna start from here. Yeah, we're gonna start from right here, even though it's a dead end. <laughs> Holy crap, okay. Uh, maybe that's a bit too high. Holy shit, that's way too, yeah, that's way too high. All right, let's go. Let's just go one notch up. How about that? <laughs> Trust me, this is going to make traffic a lot better. I promise. It's almost in parallel. That's fucking weird, but okay. <laughs> A driving advisory has been issued for the immediate That's area. That's extremely to weird. Conditions. Please exercise caution if you must. Drive All right, let's and try see to stay here. The now we need. This has been a local public we need on ramps and off ramps. A driving advisory has been issued for the immediate area due to poor road conditions. Please exercise caution if you must drive. And try to stay off the streets until conditions improve. This has been a local public service announcement. You're listening to Second Moon Radio with J. Thomas Hornbuckle. And we're pervading some of the finest classical music on the air. Keep that dial right here.
How do I want to do this? This just in from traffic. If you're thinking about hitting the streets, you can expect delays on the major roads, especially during rush hour. Mm. Good to Should know. Should I change Dan? the direction? Seems like everyone is in a hurry to get somewhere fast. It's worth slowing down. And if you can, plan right. your trip outside the rush. Oh, I don't know. I'd rather wait an hour in traffic than to have to oh, start thinking about it. Um, Besides, if I did that, I'd never get anywhere. We're we're live, um, and we're getting reports about a traffic accident. Uh, Let's see. How do I don't want to do this? Uh, I want to go. City. Road maintenance services have already been dispatched, and traffic flow should return to normal. But if you're planning a quick trip out, you might want to wait a little while until everything clears up. If you're in it, you uh, you already know about it. No use reminding you. Meanwhile, expect delays and drive safe. Oh, you go. oh really are you are you serious So this one can get onto this one and that one. Alright, and this one also needs to be able to get on to
look. Look, look. look how easy that fucking was. suck it on ramps I really do <laughs> uh, let's see here maybe It's ugly, but it works. <laughs> I'm wondering if I can just get rid of this section right here and then just loop that other part back around. Might be able to. Let's see if I can cut that up right there. And then draw a path from here. There we go. That works. All right. So now these two can get on. This way needs this way needs a way to get off. Same thing over on this side. Okay, like I said, not the prettiest, takes up a shit ton of room, but it works. It works, it works. Like I said, it's not the prettiest, I'll probably come by off camera and maybe tighten this up a little bit and make it look a bit prettier. But overall, uh, let's see here. Alright, so let's go ahead and... Five lane, eight symmetric road, eight lane divided road, six, seven lane. Now let's start widening up the avenues. Yeah, it's gonna hurt my economy because I am literally demolishing buildings in the process. But they'll rebuild. It's 
all part of the master plan. What plan, you might say, Swag? The plan to make this city the best. That is the plan. That is a wonderful plan that I'm glad I thought of with no one else's help. Um, that's gonna be a problem. Oh, come on, I can't get it underneath. Shit. Okay, well. That's a problem. There's only two openings right there. Which means I'll have to bulldoze this section. Alright. Now then, we'll do our little uffy ramps, and I'll call it an episode for this one. See that lot. I can't even like. Ugh, does it have to be back here? Yeah. Alright, there. It's fine. Once we get everything all taken care of, it'll be fine. Y'all will stop complaining. You'll have plenty of shit, and everything like that will be Pending good. Yes, it will be good. Yes, it will be good. The city will be. I know we're losing population like freaking crazy, and urge the public to remain calm during. What not? But I'm gonna go ahead and end it here, everybody. As always, thank you so much for watching. Please be sure to like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter at Should Be Wilds Gaming, or as I should say, on X at Should Be Wilds Gaming. I follow all followers back. Also, don't forget to check out Facebook and Discord. Links are in the description below. And with that being said, everybody, I will see you all in the next one. And shower with a.